Dean of Wuhan's Jinyan Tan Hospital works hard every day to save lives. But he is also fighting against amyotrophic lateral sclerosis, or ALS, himself. The hospital, where Zhang Dingyu works, mostly houses patients infected by the new coronavirus in the epicenter of the outbreak. He has to keep an eye on everything, from supplies to medical procedures. Zhang sometimes loses his patients because some medical workers are not familiar with procedures. He's like a soft-hearted lion. He shouts like thunder when he's angry, and no one can take it. But he really cares about people, and he's more attentive than I am. Zhang Dingyu and another 600 medical workers have been working to contain the virus since its outbreak. It was on the Chinese New Year's Eve, and the day after that, we reached the breaking point. Lucky for Zhang Dingyu, on the eve of Lunar New Year, medical workers from all over China started going to the virus hit city to support their colleagues. Our biggest shortage is nursing teams. At such a terrible time, receiving such aid and support is a really big help. Zhang Dingyu has been jumping from one phone call to another. Only after work, he got a chance to visit his wife a medical professional who was also infected by the virus. I was really afraid I was losing her. You don't know if the person you love will get better or worse, and there is nothing you can do about it. I was terrified. When I was driving home one day, I felt I couldn't handle it anymore, and I cried. Zhang's wife was cured and discharged on Wednesday, and he says he will fight the battle against ALS as long as he can. A lifetime is always limited, but if I can do my best, then I don't have any regrets. As of the end of January, over 200 patients have been recovered and released from Jinyantan Hospital, and that has been the best gift for Zhang Dingyu.